gotta make money on this one, buddy, or it's out on the fucking street. All we need now is these bitches to put on their costumes and show up. That's horrible. Yeah. Halloween's supposed to be scary. Yeah, but that is, um... Yeah, so you wear a scary costume, not some slutty man get an outfit like that. What, what is that? Uh, <laughs> whatever. You can't be on fix my whiskers. Slut. Or hussy. Jezebel. Tart. <sighs> You've got to be hitting me. <laughs> what? You can't be dressed like a cat. Why not? Because I told you that I was going to be a cat. She spent a long time making those ears. <laughs> I don't know why you made them. I mean, you could buy super cute ones at the drugstore. These are $5 or something. What? You're worried Dex is going to be there? <laughs> What's wrong with you? I think you must know. I'm having a bit of a chafing situation. My fishnets are not doing kind of things to my Brazilian. Ew. Uh, I have some aloe vera in the bathroom. So help yourself. Wait, where did you go? Clean cheeks. What? They're butchers. Why don't you just go to the honey pot? Because clean cheeks is the original. Okay, I'm sorry, but I don't like the idea of a beautician snapping on rubber gloves and putting hot wax on my pink parts with a popsicle stick. Oh. <laughs> wait a minute, wait a minute. So you're telling me you don't wax? No. It's not natural for me. <laughs> but guys like it better. You know what? Once they're close enough to notice, they don't care. All right, so you uh, keep the hedge trimmers by the bed then. Oh, no, no, wait. You help guide them in with flares. <laughs> You know, I'm starting to understand why you guys went as pussies for Halloween. Cats! cats. We're, We're pussy, pussy cats. Okay. <laughs> Check out the fireman. Where? Over by the mummy. Oh, that's a good hat. Yeah. <laughs> I like it. Mmm. Jesus. No, there's gonna be tons of food at Angela's. Here. Like that. Hold on, man. Look at that guy. He's gotta be 15 or 16. Oh, easily. They're giving him candy? Why are they giving him candy? Why do you think that mask, it looks like he's gonna pull a home invasion. Oh, this is so wrong. Asshole! Oh, asshole! Hey, he's going down. That's it, oh, buddy. Come on. Down. Come on. Woo! Yes. I'm going down. Wait, wait, you got him, dude. Wait for me. No costume, no candy. No costume, no candy! No costume, no candy, motherfucker! No costume, no candy! Got that? Oh my god, Angela and I used to sneak out to the Broussard Mansion all the time when we were younger. She used to tell me the wildest stories about that place. Are you sure this looks okay? Yes, God, stop worrying. You look great. Besides, after a kamikaze or two, you're not gonna care anyways. I think it's an open bar. Really? For ten dollars? Yep. Angela's been playing this party forever. How long have you known her? Since high school. She was a senior, I was a sophomore. She terrified me, but <laughs> one summer we ended up working together and got to be friends at Taco Bell. Yeah. You worked at Taco Bell? <laughs> that is awesome. No, seriously, one piece of advice about Angela. Don't let her around any guys you like. She'll go for them right away. She can't help it, though. She'll go after Dex. 
Even Cullen. Really? All right, we can do this. It's crowded. Way too many witnesses. So just go in there. You say it's great doing business with you. Shake his hand. Peace cake. So nice to see you. Yeah, hey. You too. How are things? Brave boy. Coming into the lion's den. Are you here to see Nigel? Yeah. Mm. Is he in a good mood or not? I think he is very happy. Nigel! Colin's here. Strasna желает себя видеть. Go on. another time if you'd like. No. You sit the fuck down. Okay. Are you a liar? Or are you an idiot? Look. Nige. I'm sorry. No one's willing to pay the same price anymore. That's why your cut was so low. Answer the fucking question. Are you a liar? Or are you an idiot? I'm an idiot. <laughs> <laughs> You're a smart guy. You went to college, right? You know anything about economic theory? The law of supply and demand? Now, the drug supply around here hasn't changed. And the demand, well, we're in a city that was destroyed by a fucking hurricane. People are desperate, people are unhappy, they want their fucking drugs. And I can make it up to you. So there is no way for the prices to go down. Look, there's a really huge party that's being thrown tonight by Angela Feld. Are you almost done? Not yet. Oh. Here's what I'm gonna supply. One last chance. Not a last chance to work for me. A last chance to work, to eat, to fuck, to do anything else. And here's what I'm gonna demand. Twice what you usually give me by tomorrow night. You get arrested. You get in a car accident. You get into some other unforeseen fucking tragedy and I really don't fucking care. Double my money. I don't... Supply and demand, Colin. Supply and demand.
No, 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 not tonight. Come on, I'll keep it quiet. Hey, what Angela doesn't know won't kill her, right? Come on. Yeah, no, Andrew Jackson costumes, they don't cut it. But maybe if you came and say, like, Ben Franklin, you might be able to look the other way. Enjoy the party. the whole bad boy thing, but I have no idea why you were ever with him. <laughs> oh, codependency, a Mother Teresa complex, believing I could change someone into something else, thinking that great love and great drama were the same thing. Huh. Insecurity. Oh, and the guy can fuck. <laughs> I want details. I'll give you details. Let me find the bathroom first. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Middle of the night, the silence up in the bathroom. It just scared the shit out of me. What? Come here. <laughs> Let's go get some drinks. Okay. Come on. Okay. <laughs> Bring on the 
The guy in the devil costumes count on her passing out. Yeah, you're 
Yeah, there are actually a bunch of cops down there with guns and like pepper spray. So let's go. Happy Halloween, Miss Phil. I am here legally. I rented this place. You didn't get a permit. Turn the power back on. I don't need a permit. This is a private party. You were charging admission. Yes, but my business partner stole the door fee, so technically. And I guess that makes it okay. Don't even bother to answer that. Enjoy the cleanup, my dear. Are you still here? I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Does that heating grate over there lead down to the basement? How the fuck would I know? Uh, dude. What the fuck's wrong with you? This thing needs to get out of here. No, Suzanne's not here. Thought she was gonna meet us at the car, but. <laughs> Angela. Angela, I can't find the basement. Just please help me. Please, I'll be your best friend. I go. Thank you. <laughs> Suzanne, <laughs> I, I passed out behind the go-go box. Such a disaster. Is this it? What? It seems about right. Huh. Jesus, this doesn't make any sense. I mean, aren't these pipes supposed to lead down to a furnace or something? Just freaking dead ends here. Well, I don't know. I mean, they said there were a bunch of rooms down here left over from Prohibition. Really? Yeah, in fact, there's a tunnel to the next estate over. It's pretty cool, huh? Wait a minute. Hey, Ant, check this out. Dude, I think this is a door. What? Yeah. Here, help me move these shelves. What? Let's get this shit off of here. Whoa. I love it. This is officially my dream house. Those aren't, they are, aren't they? What the fuck? Hey guys, there are bodies in the basement. You guys, I think we should call the police. That's not gonna work. I mean, we don't get service out here. I haven't got a text message all night. I think I'm gonna be sick. I mean, isn't this obvious? These have got to be the people that disappeared from Evangeline's party. Whoa. Huh. Sweet. Oh, my God, Colin. Don't worry, Maddie. I'm out of here. Bye, you guys. Come on, Angela. Fess up. You set us up tonight, just like with the mirror. You guys, this room was sealed off. Is that a 
gold tooth? Ow! <laughs> it bit her! Probably a reflex thing. <laughs> Okay, guys, fucking gate is locked. And please tell me you have the goddamn keys. Um, yeah, they're they're upstairs in my bag. Just go grab them. <sighs> Fuck. Um, let's get out of here. I'll be right behind. Oh, Creepiest yeah, shit I've ever seen. Get the fuck out of here. We'll go now. That was weird. Like this is just too fucking. <sighs> on the other side or something. No, no, I already tried. Okay, this is no good. You know, the police probably closed it when they left and it must have locked automatically. <laughs> you know what we need now? A drink. Let's go. <sighs> What's going on with you? <laughs> you don't want to know. Guess we're gonna be spending the night. Parker, Jen, what do you want? Thanks, Bob. Guys, I got it. The bodies in the basement, the way they're all arranged, it's gotta be black magic. Oh, come on. No, 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 it fits perfectly with the full story. You see, there was one survivor left that night. Evangeline's maid. When the cops came in the morning, they found her up in her room and she had gone crazy. She wrote all kinds of shit all over the walls, spells, story, everything. You see, Evangeline Broussard was in love with Louis Devereaux. But he didn't love her. She was so desperate that she turned to love spells. She started practicing all kinds of magic, voodoo, witchcraft, hoodoo, and somehow, by accident, she got in touch with evil spirits. They tricked her. They told her if she invited Louis and some friends over for a Halloween seance that he'd fall in love with her. But they had other plans. Everything started fine, and then something went very, very wrong. By the end of the night, six people had vanished. Evangeline was dead, and the maid had lost her mind. All because of the evil spirits. <laughs> <laughs> That's what the maid said. But you know what? Evangeline probably just butchered them. Or sacrificed them. <laughs> Let me hit that. Yep, yeah, sure. I don't know what else we're going to do all night. Hey, are you okay? Angela, you don't look so good. Skeleton bite. Come on. It's not a skeleton bite. Sorry. I think I need to find a bathroom.
<laughs> Good. Come on, join us. Yeah, yeah. Seven. Perfect. All right, you're up. My turn? Yep. Predictable. Yeah, Lily, it's also eternally great. So. <laughs> I wish she didn't look so stupid. Well, at least my boobs aren't hanging <gasps> out, slut. Sucks, man. There's fucking dead bodies downstairs, and you guys are playing fucking spin the bottle. Yeah, well, light as a feather, stiff as a board comes next. Yeah, and I don't think the bodies are going anywhere. You know, they've probably been there since before our parents were born, so. Mm. <laughs> Fuck it. I can't get out, so Nigel can't get in, all right? Come on, Colin. Uh, I'm up? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> see some guy on guy. No way. Come on, fair is fair. Whatever, you're chicks. You can get away with it. It's different um, for guys. That's a good point. Oh, what are you, homophobic? Oh, shut up. Rules are rules. Come on, just do, do it. it. Your turn, pucker up. Oh. Like a Band-Aid. <laughs> just do it. Come on. Whatever. You can do it. Whatever, time. All right, dude, on three. And then, right, three and then one. Two. Two and uh, Come on! Go. Shit. Come on. Go. Uh, three. Oh! Oh! No oh. Congratulations. You are officially gay. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Shh. I'm redeeming myself. Kisser. <laughs> you have no idea. Dex, I'm really so sorry. I don't mean to get jealous. It's just. Oh! What's wrong? Just got this. Are you okay? Come over here. I can make you feel better. Pretty good shit on the end. Drink. <laughs> I think that's a little much for just me. Drink. I want to get lucky. Oh my god, this fucking blows. There's got to be another gate somewhere, right? Nope. Looks like you're staying here tonight. Yeah. 
Yeah, Colin. There probably is another gate somewhere. Why don't we go look for it? Yeah, I think you're right. Okay. Would you? Sorry. You. <laughs> Want some? Sure. Just, uh, uh, wait up, guys, I'm, I'm coming with you. over in those bushes. No, it came from the house. It's just the stereo, guys. Chill. Stayed, man. She was all over me. Who, Angela? Dude, she was all over everyone, brother. What was I thinking? I could have fucked her. <sighs> shit. So how's everything been? Oh man, same old shit. A different day. 
Have you seen anyone? Uh, me? No. I think my life is way too fucked up for that shit right now, man. Oh, yeah? Yeah, definitely. <laughs> OK. There's no other gate, guys. Face it, there's no other exit. We've been around it twice. That doesn't fucking make any sense, man. It's not against, like, fire codes or some shit. This place is 150 years old. I don't think they cared about no. fire codes. People were fucking stupid 150 years ago. I gotta take a piss, I'll be right back. Want some help with that? Lily, uh, sorry, I, I didn't know you were in here. Mm, I'm sorry. <sighs> Fix my whiskers. With this? Well, be okay? Stoned or something? <laughs> Fix my whiskers. Okay. Yeah. No, not there, silly. <laughs> Wait a sec, uh, what about Tex? What the <laughs> fuck? Took a while. Yeah. Uh, uh -huh. Dude, there is some freaky stuff in this book. <laughs> freaky. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Lily, she, uh. Oh, God. Did Lily and Dex get into a fight? Is she into magic or, or anything? You know, uh, like sleight of hand and stuff? No. Oh. Okay. Uh, she, there might be something wrong with her then. What? What, what do you mean? Uh, she, she's acting, um, she, she sort of took her, her shirt off. There, were, there was, um, there, there was blood. What? And, uh, you know, you know, I, I, I don't want to talk about it. Oh, wait, I, is she hurt? I, I don't know. Uh, I, I saw, um, I, I, I saw, uh, What? Well, what did you see? She stuck a lipstick in her boob and it fell out of her pussy. Okay? She was, uh, I swear, she was right here. Well, where's the blood? It was on the floor. It was, it was everywhere. Right. Okay, I'm out of here. Dude, you're freaking seeing shit. She was, uh... Lily? Lily? Lily! <gasps> what the fuck what? was that? 
Suzanne? What? Suzanne, what? I don't see anything. Let's go, let's go. Do you think I'm Lily too? It's like they're just playing with us. What do they want? Like one attacked us and the other just stood there. Dude, why the hell are you being so goddamn logical? None of this makes any fucking sense. Got something to fight him with.
Did you see how far down it goes? Dude, I can't see a freaking thing. Something. Did you notice that? Their skin, it was like... Hey, 
We have to put pressure on it. Guys, what is this? Text. What's it say? I don't know. I think it starts here. These symbols are spells. We're safe if we stay in this room. They can't come in here. Apparently, those things that got Lily and the others are demons. They're treacherous tricksters, imps of the perverse. They delight in deception and revel in lies, spreading depravity. Uh, okay, so they're demons. Right. What the hell do they want? Death, chaos. They want to turn our world into hell's playground. You know, the sun is dark as sackcloth, lakes of liquid fire, plagues, the dead walking the earth, that kind of thing. Yeah. But first they need to be freed. Okay, you guys. This is gonna sound crazy, but... Eons ago, these demons defied divine law and tried to take the place of the devil. As a punishment, they were bound together and cast out of hell. But there's always a loophole. If demons could possess seven people over the course of one Halloween night, they'd be free. And that's where Evangeline came in. When she was practicing spells, these were the demons she contacted. They tricked her into inviting people over for a seance. The demons just needed seven bodies. And as soon as the ritual started, they started possessing people. Once one person had turned, all they had to do was kiss or bite someone to possess all the rest as well. Soon six people turned into demons, and they only needed one more. But they can't use a dead body, only a living one. So when Evangeline realized she wouldn't make it till dawn... She killed herself keep the demons from getting out. So, there it is. Uh, I don't understand something. What kind of demon gets cast out of hell? These ones. They're badass. They couldn't even follow hell's rules. So, we're the only things standing between them and the end of the world. That's awesome. Yep. And Jason was right. They really don't like the rusted iron. Yes. Told you. Well, come on. I mean, that's completely random. No, not really. Demons are made from ancient elements. Iron's an ancient element. Rust corrupts it. So you put the two together, and demons don't like it. That makes sense. Well, whether I want to believe this or not, I mean, these bastards want to kill us, right? So we don't really have any choice. Yeah. They only have tonight, Halloween. Mm -hmm. It gets light at six. We wait until dawn.
you. I, I got it. I did it. Um. <gasps> Holy shit. You can't come in here. The spells on the walls keep you out. <laughs> oh, there are ways. There are always ways. You still have a thing for him, don't you? I have a thing for him, too. I'm gonna poke his pretty brown eyes out and fuck his brains out until they're spilling out of his ears. And right before he takes his last gasp, right before he becomes one of us, he shall know the place where ecstasy and suffering become one. Shut up, bitch. No oh, shit, I'm awake, I'm awake. What was that? <clears throat> Angela, we were right about the spells. She couldn't get in. Huh. Angela was here. But it's okay, we're safe. How's your leg? It's okay, she was just fucking with us. I think I'll live. I don't feel so good, though. Can I get you water or something? Uh, I'm okay. Guys, guys. It's my imagination, or is it getting light out? Yeah. <laughs> it's gonna be morning soon. <laughs> Thank God. Right. So, we just, like, sit around here? One more hour, and then we're golden. Yeah. <laughs> I think we're all free. Yeah. We rock. We did it. <laughs> yes. <laughs> we kicked their asses. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> uh, guys? The walls. What? But they can't get in, right? You said they can't get in! It's washing away all the symbols. Oh my god. I think it's over. I think they're gone. Oh. I don't know. We think so. We made it.
Grab anything with rust on it. Oh, this ought to do it. I think we're okay. Yeah. Yeah. Not the key. I think we can get out. No, it's probably open. I mean, the demons were the ones that locked us in. We'll be okay. Something's not right. What the hell? What's going on? What's happening? It's, it's a trick! You got us the fucking night. <laughs> screwed. If I don't get killed by freaking demons, Nigel's gonna blow my goddamn brains out and he'll find my fucking body strewn all over the fucking place. God, would you just shut up? Please. Jason is dead, for God's sakes, and all you've been talking about all night is like me, me, me. You're right. I'm sorry. I know. in there. 
There's no spells on the walls. Did it bite you? You know what? I think the thing wanted to fuck me. Yeah, well, uh, that is kind of one of the ways that they... something to splint it with, oh, all right? No. Shh, it's okay. Oh, oh my God, it hurts. Oh, oh, God. Oh, my God, I'm gonna die. Fuck! Oh. Okay. Oh, okay. Oh. You're gonna be okay. Oh. Oh. on three, okay? No. Yeah, no. you'll be okay. No, no. All right, one. No. Two. No.
smart. Angela here, here to pick up the sound equipment. It's inside. Wild party, huh? Yeah. You have no idea.
Are you almost done? Not yet. 